Welcome to the in-depth iMovie 10 series of courses. This is a group of four courses designed to really give you a mastery over this pretty amazing new program, uh, this new version of, of iMovie that Apple's just released. And it's really going to be a fun course where you're going to learn not just about how to use the software, but hopefully about why to use it and the different ways to make the most of it. And this first course, this is the first of four, and this is really going to focus on importing and organizing your footage. So we'll get into editing and special effects and all the cool things you can do with the program in the subsequent courses. But to get started, it's really important to think about how you get the footage into the program and how you organize it. And there's a lot of cool tricks and tools that the software provides to make that both easy and robust. And, you know, one of the cool things about iMovie is that you can use it the way many people use iPhoto. The way you use iPhoto to manage your photo co collection, you can use iMovie to manage your video collection. And as people accumulate more and more video, you know, with everybody's got a video camera in their pocket now on their smartphone, as well as video cameras that are widespread and inexpensive and you can get great quality video very easily, or, you know, even the iSight camera on your computer. I mean, there's so many ways to accumulate video content that it becomes very unwieldy if you're not managing it effectively. And iMovie 10 provides some pretty cool organizational tools to help you do that. And so we're going to get into all that cool stuff. We're going to start this course by talking about the different ways to import footage into iMovie uh, from different types of devices. And then we'll get into importing other types of files like music files or still image files uh, or files from other programs. And then we're going to get into managing the library, which is really how the files are organized inside of iMovie 10. And we'll talk all the different options you have for that. And then we'll get into working with individual clips, learning how to view them and skim them and then how to identify the parts that you like and then how to find those parts that you've identified and, and different things uh, regarding managing individual clips. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump in. My name is Michael Wool. I'll be your host and your guide and hopefully an effective teacher as you learn all the cool things there are to know about iMovie 10.